Where are you guys from? I'm from Japan. Okay. Yeah. I'm from Hilton Head, South Carolina. Park City, Utah. All right, so what do you guys think of the course, CNO one Very informative. Yeah. yeah. It, uh, kind of blew our minds a little bit, opened up our minds. Are you glad he came? Definitely. So quit thinking just teeth. Yeah, yeah you're looking at teeth, but yeah. mm -hmm. you gotta see in my world, I've looked already at joints. Mm -hmm. So I'm asking myself, based on what I saw in the scans yesterday, is that toothpaste or joint paste? Regardless, I'm asking, it's kind of academic because I'm gonna make that adjustment. And the reason I do the scans, as Cameron got yesterday, right, mm -hmm. is because I'm looking for stable and adapted. So the MRI and the CT tells me. So if they're not stable and adapted, I'm not going to do this to them in Japan or in the U.S., okay? What we do different is we look to see if they're stable and adapted. Nobody does that. Because there's times where you can help people a bunch by just doing this. A measured anterior guidance catches the patient's bite up to the status of their stable and adapted joints. Confirm, objectively confirm stable and adapted joints. That's what this does. If my scans are telling me the right thing and if I interpret it properly, and if he's lucky, this is the biggest part of his main problem. Because I have all these measurement tools I've been using for years, yeah. and oh, I don't think a lot of people do have that. So. Are you, you, you've got the BioPack, right? I the do. BioPack? Yes. And you've been using it a long time. Yeah, T scan, EMG link I have. Mm -hmm. I've got. Uh, cone beam, mm -hmm. I, I mean, all the stuff. You haven't shot any MRIs yet. I haven't shot any MRIs. You're getting ready though, aren't you? Yes. You're starting to think about yeah. it. Yeah. I think we have to do it. Uh huh. I mean, yes. No what do you think? About it. I MRIs so. available in your country? Yeah, yes. Easy, right? Uh, available. Yeah, yeah, easy, right? So, near the uh, hospital. Yep. So, took MRI. Yep. And you can send it off and it's all good. You'll get the report yes. and you'll be able to interpret okay. yourself. Right. Yeah. Because we're going to teach you how to interpret, right? Yeah. <laughs> Us or Dr. Piper will. You should uh, teach this in dental school. This should be course a course given in dental school. I, I you yeah, know, and, and we we've been, we've been talking, and we think that probably MRIs are going to at some point be the standard of care, mm -hmm. like cone beams becoming. If I have anything to say about it, that's mm -hmm. I yeah. hope to be part of that. Yeah.